please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I can do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. Your family. Besides, if they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. I'm a pro at this point. I happen to be an expert relaxer. If only you weren't a degenerate gambler, too. Ouch. Damn, too soon. Nah, I know you don't mind, but I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Forget you said what? Thanks. So where do you think you'll go? Don't know. With what happened, I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Well, here's hoping. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Wanna take me with you? Well? Well, what about David? <laughs> What about David? Kate. I know, I know. I'm just messing around. It's just hard to say no to a fresh start. I always wanted to go to Norway, see the northern lights. You'll be jet setting and I'll still just be here. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh Ooh, shit. Quick, shit, run shit, underwater. Shit. Well, that was David's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh, it's so annoying. Glasses break, he'll understand. Not with this glass. <sighs> there you go. See, much better. What was that noise? Guys! You're... You're gonna be okay. Hello? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not gonna give me another well, one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh, here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? It is just a glass. It was important to me, Javi. A glass? We don't see your ass for a year. A year. Then when your life goes to shit, we're expected to drop everything and roll out the red carpet. All for Prince Javi. And now you're gonna start telling me how to talk to my wife? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. Always judging everyone. Except himself. You know what, David? Time for you to open your eyes. Kate's gonna leave your ass. What? She told Hi. me so. You said that? Jesus fucking Christ, no! We were talking about traveling and I just... No, I definitely didn't say that. At all. Three days. Then I want you off my couch and out the door. We clear? Fine. Javi, that is my husband. We are married. In case you forgot. That's for life. Hey, take it easy. What happened? They got away. Oh god. Mariana. I already dug a grave for her. Thank you.
You deserve so much better than this. Fuck, it wasn't supposed to go like this. Javi, thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. I couldn't leave you alone. That's because you're a good man. Well, not good enough to save her. You bought your people time, though. That counts for something. Hey, hang on a sec. She carried this around for years. I'm sorry I never found you those candy bars. You deserved just so much more life. You should have been the one burying me. Some someday. Someday far away. You did everything you possibly... The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? I've run into these guys before. Who are they? Please? They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have. It's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. Bad how? I got out. That's all that matters. They left one of their cars behind. That's something at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. I can take you back to Prescott, make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. You should stay with us. Let's just get back to Prescott. You're back. How's Kate? Uh, she... Just came out of surgery. 
Eleanor's still with her. You'd best get over to the infirmary. You made it back. She asked for you. You know. Please, please just tell me how she's doing. Well, she came through the surgery as well as could be expected. Those bastards did her one favor at least. Any lower, and that bullet would have torn her stomach lining as well. Your boy Gabe. He seems really fierce. He wanted to help so badly. He practically forced me to let him stay. That's Gabe. But she was bleeding so much he... got overwhelmed. So when's she gonna be up on her feet again? She's stable. For now. But she's still bleeding inside. I don't wanna lie to you. It's probably just a matter of time. I... I wish I could do more. Thanks for trying. And for not sugarcoating it. Wish I had something better to tell you. But I'm sorry, Javi. I'm going to get cleaned up. You may want to find Gabe. He looked pretty upset when he left. This isn't going to make him feel any better. Still. I'll track him down. How's she doing? Not great. As well as can be expected. Yeah, considering. You should have come back with us. Your family, they needed you. What you did? I'm grateful. I still think they would have preferred to have you there instead of me. It's a hell of a situation. Just know I'm praying for you. All of you. And whatever happens, you all are welcome to stick around in Prescott, if that's what you want. Nobody's gonna force you, but we'd be glad to have you all here. Not gonna make a decision like that without talking to Kate, so... I'd rather check in with her when she's feeling better, you know? Sure thing. Let the lady weigh in first. I flew in a plane just like this to a baseball game in Arkansas once, a lifetime ago. Hey, have you seen a kid come through here? Blood all over his hands, dark look on his face. Headed off that way, without saying a word. If I were you, I'd give him some space. Just my advice, one parent to another. Yeah, well, I don't need your advice. Just trying to help. Honest. That blood, I take it that wasn't his? His stepmom's. You gotta stay strong for her. Do whatever it takes. Know if my friends seen you in the same situation, I'd fight like hell. Anything we can do to help you out, just let me know. I, uh, appreciate that. Your boy stomped off towards the front gate. Gabe? Gabe, come on. Look at me. I want to go back and bury Mariana. We buried her. It was... peaceful. How could it have been peaceful? I know how much you miss her, Gabe. I miss her, too. And Kate, she needed me during her surgery. She needed my help. I just ran away like a stupid little kid. You stayed long enough to do some good. And because of that, I'm proud of you. You were there for her, as much as you could be. That doesn't count. I'm done feeling this way. Feeling powerless. I can't be some helpless little boy anymore. I need to be a man, just like my dad was. He knew how men were supposed to act. 
You're already a man, Gabe. I'm not. But at least I know it now. Next time, I'm not gonna sit back and watch. I'm gonna do something. I have to. Listen, Gabe. Get inside! Now! We might have to leave. Make sure Kate's ready. You can count on me. Don't you kick their ass out. Knock, knock! Anyone home? Shit. He was one of the men at the junkyard. These are those freaks that brand themselves. I wish we hadn't had to come all the way out here, but unfortunately, Badger here says you attacked his man. He says you fired on him. Took out a lot of our people. They shot first. They killed my niece. Shot a woman in cold blood. How many of my friends died because of you, huh? Sounds like a bunch of he said, she said shit to me. Well, what the fuck do you want? An apology? What I really want is for my dead buddies to be alive again. But I don't think that's too likely, is it? He needs to come with us. Answer to justice. Accept his punishment. Men have got to have laws. Otherwise, we're no better than the animals. Go fuck yourselves. You're not getting shit from us. That gate ain't bulletproof. Don't make me prove it. The fact of the matter is, you stole from us. You killed some of us. Give it up now and get down here. I think they need a little incentive. Chrissy! <laughs> you hurt her, I'll kill you. Whoa. You didn't tell me you had a hostage. It's gonna be okay, baby. I love you, baby. All right, baby. Just... just give them what they want. There's no reason this has to get ugly. But we ain't leaving without what we came for. You hurt her, and I'll hurt you back worse than you could ever imagine. Big words. The words are just that. Oh, oh my god! Now get your ass down oh here, or please. I cut off the rest of them! What the hell are you doing? Javi, please, man. Just just go with him. You got to. He'll kill Francine. Nobody's giving in to them. We should start shooting. No fucking.